when I was a kid, I thought, well, you know, I set five goals for myself. And if I, I thought if I got those five goals in life, then I'd be happy. Sure enough, I became a number one New York Times bestselling author. I have a wonderful husband, lovely home, great friends. I don't have Halle Berry's body, but you know, four out of five isn't bad. And I still wasn't really happy. Something was missing. And I think there's a lot of people in the world that feel that way. We're, we're accomplishing a lot of the goals that we set out to accomplish, but something is still missing. What I learned through writing the women's books in the Chicken Soup for the Soul series, you know, I read over 20,000 stories for those books, is that people are soul starved. We are craving these positive, inspiring, uplifting stories. And what I wanted to do with Happy For No Reason was take it a step further. Chicken Soup gave you the inspiration, but it didn't give you the how-tos. We all have a happiness set point. You may be familiar with the idea of having a weight set point that you gen generally tend to stay within a certain weight range unless you do something consciously to change your metabolism. Well, in a similar way, we have a happiness set point that's about 50% genetic and 50% learned. And the good news is that we've cracked the code on happiness. There's really tremendous research out there about how to raise your happiness level, and that's what Happy For No Reason is about. When I tell people that I've written a book called Happy For No Reason, they very often quote me the famous line from the Declaration of Independence. I'm entitled to life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. Well, do you know that back in Thomas Jefferson's day, the word pursuit does not mean to chase after. Here we are all thinking we're supposed to chase after happiness. Back then, the word pursuit meant to practice. What I found and what I actually say in The Secret is that many people feel that when th they get all the success in life, then they'll be happy. The real secret of the law of attraction is that success doesn't bring us happiness or gathering all these things doesn't bring us happiness. That's backwards. Happiness is what brings us success.